uh, just the, the nostalgia cars. Yeah. So, what are they going to think when they see these? Uh, I hope so. <laughs> Apparently, there are some people here that were like, they're just here to see the cars, they're not even here to see the concerts. Well, we'll take welcome. What's about to happen, Joe Costello? We are at the Texas Motorplex, and we are about to witness the greatest spectacle this place has ever seen. We've got two top fuel dragsters getting ready to light it up. You got Alex Laughlin, you got Scott Palmer. You'd think they're going to just do an exhibition for concert goers? No, it is a race. As you can imagine, drag racers, up, 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 $1,000, $5,000, $10,000, $17,500 wager. All the sponsors are in on it. These guys are racing for real. Plus, we got jets. We got thousands of people in the grandstands. We thought they were just concert goers, like straggling over. They're here to see nitro cars. This race right now it is awesome. This is what the Stampede of Speed is all about. Where are you? Scott Palmer, ever the showman. And you get to display drag racing on a grand stage at this moment. Well, you know what? Pretty much everything I do is just directed towards showing off. So we race the wheelie bar way up over NHRA maximum limit. Just just so Ned and uh, Gwen and Josh know, it's a, up above the limit. So we're going to see if we can ride a wheelie out of here against Alex Laughlin. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a mega party next week, and we're going to start it right now. And we're going to throw down, and we're going to put on a show for you fans. I tell you what, this is a show here tonight, but if you get a chance to get over here next weekend, we're going to put on a hell of a show, 330 mile an hour show. So let's go have some fun doing it. Let's drink some beer tonight. Let's have some fun. What do you guys think? Yeah. about Friday night we get to, to go out there and throw down and see if we can win a little extra money for a little extra cash uh, for being the lowest and fastest out there you know so uh, as cool as the show it is here tonight with Brett Young I'm excited to put on a show next weekend here at the Texas Motorplex and uh, really throw down and see what these funny cars can do out there 
It seems like here recently, in HRA drag racing in particular, there's been a lot of like first pitches in baseball. You're able to pump up a crowd for a concert. It seems like it's been getting its due lately. Well, you know, I mean, we've been selling out crowds every weekend. You know, every Saturday that I've seen, you know, you do a burnout and you look around and you're backing up and there's not a place to sit, there's not a place to stand. And uh, that's a cool feeling. It gives me chill bumps there in a funny car. You know, when you're backing up and you're looking around, all those folks there to see you, you know, make those runs. And, uh, you know, it's just something that I think our sport is, is kind of come do you know what I mean we we have a, an amazing platform and uh, you know something that we can offer where no one else can and 3,000 you know uh, 80,000 foot pounds of torque and you know 11 12,000 horsepower and it just it's just incredible you know and, and 330 miles an hour in under four seconds so and that, that's hard to tell someone about that but once you get out here and see that I thought it was an amazing deal what they did tonight was to have all these folks over here you know at a concert and then light off two top fuel cars and jet cars and then those folks that have never experienced that got to hear and feel and see that you know and hopefully next weekend they come back and become NHRA fans so I think that's that was a, a brilliant idea you know with these folks here at the Texas Motorplex what they put together and did. Matt next weekend fall nationals NHRA who wins funny car? Uh, we, I want another cowboy hat so bad I can't stand it, you know, and it's a dogfight out there. I mean, between me, Robert, and Caps, it's, it's absolutely every round you throw down. And, and uh, you know, we're kind of in the point right now with the championship hunt that we, we have to come out swinging. You know, we, we don't have a whole lot to lose. We're 103 back uh, with three races to go. It's still very doable and still, you know, uh, able to, to, to seal up this championship this year. But we have to make Texas uh, very, very, you know, I guess important for us and, and go out here and throw down. We have to win Texas. That's Matt, concert pumper upper Hagen. Thank you guys.